going on everybody and welcome to another video on this YouTube channel and you don't know who I am my name is Jeremy and welcome to Jeremy's Wild World so guys as you saw from today's title today's video is going to be a mystery box unboxing now if you're wondering where I got this mystery box from I purchased it from Mantis Mayhem and if you don't know who they are I will link their website as well as their Instagram down in the description below go check them out they're a great company now the mystery box I purchased from them is a £10 mystery box containing two to three Mantids now, I purchased this because I've been wanting more mantids for a long time. As you guys know, I have Dice, my giant Asian mantis, who I love so much, but I want to expand my collection. So hopefully it should be arriving today. Um, shipping says that it should be arriving by 1pm, so fingers crossed it will arrive soon. Now, before I get into today's video, I just wanted to say to you guys, according to my YouTube statistics, a lot of you guys aren't subscribed who watch my videos so if i could just quickly tell you to click the subscribe button down below turn on the notification bell it's free and you won't miss a video when i upload again now i will cut back into the video once the mystery box arrives so guys it's currently the next day after i recorded the intro for the video and unfortunately the mystery box did arrive a little bit later than expected but as you can see i have it right here now that's no fault to mantis mayhem it's most likely due to royal mail and you know the whole lockdown situation and you know people not working um but that's no fault to mantis mayhem but anyways enough said let's get right into the unboxing all right guys so now for the most exciting part of today's video the actual unboxing of the mystery box so of course i ordered this from mantis mayhem and i did end up choosing a mystery box just because i didn't know which mantis i wanted to get i've been wanting mantises again for a very long time uh, i've just been very indecisive uh, when i went to the checkout i left a message saying could i get some unique mantid species so hopefully um i get some stuff that i really want and yeah so starting off with here is their business card mantis mayhem again check them out on their website as you can see their facebook and their website is um in the business card and yeah, so I'm going to be obviously keeping that. This right here, just uh, the receipts. So I'll just put that to the side. Now let's get into what's inside here. So starting off with, I got some enclosures, as you can see right here. These are 32 ounce cups with mesh lids. So um, the nymphs can obviously uh, molt properly, uh, nice and big. These guys can probably stay in here for a very long time. Depending on the species, I may or may not have to take them out of these enclosures. And if I do not need them anymore for the mantises, I can always use them for something else. So I got three of them. They were £1.20 each. Now let's get to the exciting bit. Ooh, let's have a look here, guys. So starting off with this little guy right here. As you can see, um, as I'm uh, guessing, oh, here we go. Here is the Indian Double Shield Mantis. The scientific name is P. Medio Constrictor. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right, but I will get some better footage of these guys uh, once I get them unboxed. So that's really cool, a Double Shield Mantis. The next Mantis is, wow, a Peacock Mantis. I was really debating on whether or not I wanted one. And as you can see, it did molt during shipping. Wow, that is awesome. And the scientific name for this little guy is uh, P. Pinna Pavanosis. Is that how you pronounce it? Not too sure. But yeah, that's really cool. And the last one. Ooh, a budwing mantis. So this is P. Affinis. As you can see in there, don't know how well you can see that. But yeah, so. I've got three mantids, so that's really awesome. So I'm going to get some substrate and stuff and set up their enclosures. And I'm going to show you guys what I've set them up in. So guys, here are the final enclosures that I came up with for each of the new mantises that I got in today's mystery box. Now, as you can see, each of the enclosures has the label that I managed to peel off as best as I could from the containers that they came in. I put them on here for aesthetic reasons. Uh, they look nice as well as uh, being able to identify which one's which. Now for the inside of each enclosure, as you can see, there is densely packed coca fiber substrate, as well as some moss and some sticks. Now it's looking really simple, I know, but as they get older, I will change it around and we will make it look nicer. But for now, I just wanted to make sure that they were able to access the lids. Uh, the reason being is because the lids have this fabric on top, which allows them to hang upside down when they do get bigger and they do need to molt. Of course, right now, if they do need to molt, they are small enough to hang from the sticks, but if they wanted to go to the lid, um, they're able to do so. 
just to get a quick look at each one before I end the video today, guys. This is the Budwing Mantis. And as you can see, the clarity of these cups are really, really nice. And he or she is just chilling on the little stick. And for each of one of these guys, I am hoping for females. Um, the reason being is because females do live longer than male mantids. So make the most out of them. So as you can see, here is the double shield mantis. Looking really, really nice. And last but not least, the peacock mantis. Now, I'm probably going to give these guys a little spray down later, give them some water, attempt to feed them some mealworms since I do not have any fruit flies at the moment. I should have ordered some, but I forgot. And yeah, so that's pretty much it for today's video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let's get into the outro. Well, that's the end of today's video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did of unboxing the mystery box and seeing what mantids I got today. Now, before I end today's video, I just wanted to quickly say if you have any name suggestions for any of the three mantids I got in today's mystery box, leave a like on today's video and leave a comment down below. I will be picking any of the names that you guys suggest and will be shouting you out in the next video that I do upload. Now, that's the end of today's video. If you guys enjoyed my video today, I'd really appreciate if you click the subscribe button as well as the notification bell down below so you don't miss out when I do upload again. I'd also really appreciate if you guys would follow me on Instagram, Jeremy's World World underscore. The username will be in the description below too. I post videos and pictures of the inverts and animals I do keep when I do not upload on YouTube. So yeah, that's pretty much the end of today's video, guys. Leave a like, leave a comment of the name, or if you just enjoyed the video in general, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.